Yeah, hello and welcome to another Duel Masters random collection opening. And let's go right into this like weird packaging. That's it. Oh yeah, let's go. Dimension Gate. Search your deck, you may take a creature from your deck, show that creature to your opponent and put it into your hand. And shuffle your deck. And it's a shield trigger. That's very interesting in this um, game because shield trigger is kind of your yeah your shields. Shields are basically your life points. So you have like five life points, and the enemy chooses which sh shields he breaks. So if he chooses this one because they are like set and turned down and randomly chooses this one, you can activate the ability without paying its mana cost. When this spell is put into your hand from your shield zone, you may cast it immediately for no cost. So yeah, that's interesting. Because you can search for a creature. That's very nice. Very life. Put the top card of your deck to your mana zone. It's kind of mana evolution card and also a shield trigger. Nice. Instead of having this creature attack, you may tap it to use its ability. One of your creatures into in the battle zone gets plus 5000 power until the end of the turn. Yeah, that's pretty strong. But you will have to keep in mind if you if you tap it and you put it like you have to put it like this on the field the enemy can attack this creature so it can be chosen as a target for an attack from the opponent so it most likely gets overrun in the next turn by the opponent so you have to keep that in mind Yeah, basically plus 2000 if he attacks. Yeah, that's pretty strong. I guess. But it's the same as before. If you tap it, if you use the ability, the enemy can choose it as a target attack with his own creatures. That's the same like fairy life effect. Again. Again. Another fairy life, which is really nice. Put it on the side. Another one. Now the yellow cards. One of your opponent's creatures in the battle zone and tap it. Yeah, not bad. Because you can, for example, tap a blocker and then he can not use it this turn to block something. Yeah, a blocker can block attacks, like it says. That is also very nice. Oh, and the rare one. No foil, but... May return a spell from your mana zone to your hand. Okay. Choose a shield and look at it, then put it back where it was. It's a forever blocker. Tap two creatures. Plus 
protective force. One of your creatures in the battle zone that has blocker gets plus 4000 power until the end of the turn. Nice one. In the yellow cards you have a lot of blockers. Turn a spell from your mana zone into your hand. Instead of attacking you can tap it. Aqua Surfer. It's nice when you purchase the shield trigger. And when you put this creature into the battle zone, you may choose a creature in the battle zone and return it to its owner's hand. It's nice. Energy stream. Very nice card. Aqua Hulkus, also nice. You can draw a card when he comes into play. Jellyfish. Docker. Not bad. Another blocker. Choose one of your creatures in the battle zone. It can't be blocked this turn. Also a nice card. Aqua Surfer. Shock Hurricane. Return any number of your creatures from the battle zone to your hand. Then you may choose that many of your opponent creatures in the battle zone and return them to your opponent's hand. Also some blockers. Turn a card from your mana zone to your hand. Sp spiral gates, very nice, because you can choose a creature in the battle zone and return it to its owner's hand, like Aqua Surfer. Another energy stream, draw two cards, very nice card. Spiral gate, Sopion. Another blocker. Turn a card from your mana zone to your hand. Spiral Gate, Neon Cluster, draw two cards instead of attacking. Also nice card. Tropical. And some red cards. Let's see. Yeah, you can destroy a creature with 2000 or less. This adds 2000 to a creature. Has to attack every turn. Two black cards and two oil cards at the end. So yeah, thank you for watching, I hope to see you soon.